Hey all here OS Reviews, you're watching our hands-on review of the One More Triple Driver Wireless Bluetooth in-ear headphones. So about a year ago we reviewed the original One More Triple Drivers and they are absolutely amazing sounding IEMs or in-ear monitors for the price. They're audiophile grade, uh, sound is very clean, very precise, and crisp. But a lot of smartphones these days have gotten rid of that auxiliary port in lieu of just a Type-C connector, which is still a little annoying. So one more has come out with basically a Bluetooth variant of those, and it also has high-res audio certified this time around. It has one dynamic driver and two balanced armatures with the LDAC lossless audio technology, which claims to have pretty much lossless latency. So it's three times faster transmission speed than most other Bluetooth uh, in-ear style headphones on the market. Now, pricing-wise, these are Going to sell $200, which is definitely more than you'll pay for, let's say, a more generic pair of wireless Bluetooth headphones. And it's also more than the standard triple drivers because, again, there's more components now. And the battery life is rated at seven hours. Now, with that being said, what One More has built on here is rapid charging. So 10 minutes of charging can give you up to three hours of audio playback. Now, in your cell headphones, have a ton of portability. So they're great if we're traveling, they're great for listening to music discreetly. With that being said, a challenge of these products compared to say over your style or studio style headphones has always been packing up enough punch, enough bass for instance, but that's why one more's kind of multiple driver setup with more powerful stacked designs to kind of imitate and give you more sound. Underneath this, we have the accessories, including a ton of spare silicon tips. They're all labeled by size as well. So it goes from 14.5 millimeters down to 10 millimeters, and they're also categorized by material. So we have silicon tips for casual and sports use, and we have foam tips for close listening if you're trying to pick apart the music. So here we have the charging cable, and it's actually using USB Type-C, so the newest standard, and that's part of the reason why it's able to achieve that really fast charging rate. We also have a soft carrying pouch included, and it's fine for these because they can fold down. The entire neckband is soft, so you can bend it, and it sits into a very small package. Uh, it's actually a waterproof case as well, which is pretty cool. We have the standard One More stickers, which we've been seeing for a long time now, kind of their product warranty card, as well as quick user guide documenting the various features. All right, so taking a closer look at the design of these headphones first, Again, the band itself is made out of silicon, so it's very easy to just kind of uh, flex away and then tuck into something like that pouch for easy transportation. Now, these tips are actually made out of plastic as opposed to aluminum, even though they look like metal. Um, so it still retains a lightweight form factor. Now we have a power key on the very top, and we also have a microphone. What's interesting is it's pointing on the inside of your neck is where you'll find the controls for things like volume rocker as well as the play pause key for adjusting the music and there's also some labels for left and right. Uh, there is a red accent which is uh, kind of the signature color of one more so it's a very overall attractive and clean look. Now the earbuds themselves aren't retractable so they are just sitting on the outside. They're also not magnetic on the tips like on some of the other solutions so they don't actually again attached together like this so they are a little bit easy to get tangled up. They do have the exact same shape and ergonomics as the regular one more wired earbuds. Here's a size comparison, the new triple driver Bluetooth on the right and the old triple driver with 3.5 millimeters on the left. There is slight differences in the color. We had more of a gold shine on the originals versus this one, which has more of a, this metal, aluminum, titanium look to them. Moving into sound quality, these are ridiculously, disgustingly good. I don't even understand at this point. They sound perhaps even better than many headphones, over your style headphones that you would buy for $100, $150. There's just a ridiculous amount of bass and also clarity in the mids and highs. So as far as earbuds go, I would say that uh, these are probably one of the best sounding that you'll find. Definitely on par with the regular triple drivers, which again are critically acclaimed for that reason alone, since everything just sounds crystal clear and you hear all the layers of the music that you are listening to, all the nuances. It's again, a very impressive, almost amazing experience. What I will say though is these are still probably not geared towards exercise or sports, even though they're wireless. And I say that because the neckband here, if you are running and jogging around, it does 
kind of bob up and down on your neck, which uh, isn't a huge deal, but it's not quite as stable in that sense as, for instance, true wireless earbuds. That is just one thing to know about these neckband styles in general. They're also quite noise isolating just because of the design. However, the most interesting new feature, it's called ENC technology, and if I pull up their website here, you can tell that this is what it looks like. Catered towards the microphones built onto the headset, so it does promise to cancel out any environmental noise up to 15 decibels, so if you're in a really crowded environment like an airport, your phone calls still sound crystal clear on the microphones. It's been very consistent as well in terms of connection. As long as you have your phone uh, kind of within the range of 10 meters or 33 feet, you should be completely fine. That's more or less it for our hands-on review of the One More Triple Driver Bluetooth in your headphones. I would say that it's probably going to be a very successful product for them because it's a premium audiophile grade in your style headset, but also Bluetooth, which I think a lot of folks would really appreciate. There's definitely a niche for that in the market because it seems many of these headphones are catered for sports or exercising and sacrifice the audio quality, uh, which again, Bluetooth headphones have historically have gotten the stigma of being you know not quite as audiophile grade but one more is certainly trying to change that perception and these are doing a great job they have pretty much the exact same uh, sound stage have the exact same listening experience as the regular wired triple drivers except now it's in a wireless form factor works for pretty much every single genre and just is a great seamless experience and you don't have to use those annoying dongles anymore if you are using it with a phone that doesn't have a 3.5 millimeter jack TWS earbuds would never get to the same extent of these when it comes to audio quality and detail and performance and bass. So you can check out more details about these as well as our original review on the One More Triple Driver uh, IEMs, the wired one, uh, in the links down below. And in that video we go into a bit more detail about the specific uh, sound quality and you know what it's like listening to music through those. But that's pretty much it for this video. Thanks for watching here at OS Reviews. That's been the One More Triple Driver wireless Bluetooth earbuds.